Bum, 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 bum. Greetings all. Last Outrider here with a more and more infrequent video. This time I'm talking about the coronavirus and Nurgle. For a little pretext, over the years, Nurgle players and fans have loved to portray their preferred armies as not really chaos, almost chaos light, right? Grandfather Nurgle, the nice chaos. He's really not that bad chaos. You know what I mean? Um, and, and I've never understood <laughs> that philosophy. And this is a current events situation which shows just how nasty Nurgle is. Look around you and ask yourself if you're one of the people who was on lockdown during the uh, uh, virus and wherever you happen to be, if there was a group of people out there, a group of people who were able to worship a being, from this being said to them, hey, if you go out and get 10 other people sick, I'll make sure you don't get the virus. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to throw coronavirus parties. I want you to encourage people to go out. Hug. Who cares about that social distancing thing? We need as many people as sick as possible. And for every one you do, well, then we will make you that much safer. And then these little groups of people who have this apparent immunity to all the sickness and suffering going around, they get more and more influence and more and more followers while others are all dying and, and the virus gets stronger and mutates and probably has all other types of horrible, heinous effects because that's just going to get more followers, right? We don't just want double pneumonia. We want pox and pus and blindness and pain and suffering and scabies and skin slowing off and all other types of horrific, visceral effects so that people can see that you're not affected, but they are. And I ask all those Nurgle players now who think eh, he's really not that bad. Some people are misguided to the point that they even Hakuna Matata the motherfucker and say, oh, it's just the cycle of life. Things die and decay and it's really not that bad. Well... I think this is a wake-up call to Nurgle players. And I wonder if anybody's bringing their Nurgle army to a tabletop while they're at their lockdown and would like to, you know, proselytize their beliefs on how disease and decay and things like that don't really affect people as much as, say, Corn or Zinch or Slanesh. He's just so nice. <laughs> that's my thinking during this whole process, and that's my, my quick update that I think people can finally truly understand why Nurgle is a part of chaos a part of corruption and destruction just as much as all of the rest and just as harmful. That's my 40K philosophy video for today. I hope you enjoyed it and until next time, bye. <laughs>